to the total cost, right? Because before we had this total cost, this 237.69 that we needed to apply out to the units that are still uh, in our in, in our department and those that were transferred out. So this then is the units that are still in our department. Uh, are not This is the dollar amount of, that's still in our department and those transferred out in terms of dollars. So now if we sum this up for our check figure, it should be this plus this, which will give us the check figure here, letting us know that we applied this out. And if you think about it, mull over this calculation and you'll consider that this is, we're basically using a kind of a ratio type of calculation uh, to figure out the application of this dollar amount based on uh, the, the equivalent number of units, cost per equivalent units, to these two components. Because these two components, of course, add up to the uh, 6534 to the totals. And therefore, uh, it, has to, it has to work out to work out evenly. And this is just basically our check figure to make sure that we have done so.